I'm from Wheat Ridge, Colorado. I'm from South Bend, Indiana. I'm a marketing major. I'm a psychology major. I've been getting into cooking lately, which is really fun. And I taste test most of those things he cooks. So just to make how, sure how he's am doing I, am okay. I good? He's not bad. He's not bad. I'll give him that. I'll give him that. What was the, the chicken thing you made a few weeks ago was really good? Uh, was it the, the chicken marsala he made? Was very oh good. yeah, and my but my best dish I think is a carbonara. Pretty simple, cheap. Haven't haven't tried the carbonara. I haven't been privileged yet. <laughs> <laughs> I would love to open up a restaurant. I think that would be a blast. Yeah, I'll come. I'll come try your restaurant though. Maybe I'll be a, a taste tester. You know, you can't just be. Around. No, you have to carry your weight. You're not just gonna show up and taste <laughs> everything. You gotta. You're, you're, you'll be waiting. You'll be waiting. That's tables fine. And washing That's fine. Dishes. I'll be a greeter. I'll be a greeter. I'm a, <laughs> yeah, I'm a very a pleasant greeter. person. I can be a greeter. You know what? I could. I could help cook the breakfast. I know a lot of breakfast. We're creations. not serving breakfast. Yeah, okay. Well, you know what? <laughs> you can learn the fiddle with me. There you go. There you go. I'm, I'm trying to learn the fiddle right now. It's really hard, and I'm not good at it. But I'm learning, and I'm trying. <laughs> He's, I can. I can attest to that. He's not very good yet. Yeah. <laughs> Every year we'll we'll have one bus trip, uh, usually to Penn State or Ohio State, and that's kind of a long trip. So we want to do something that'll entertain us, and we make the freshmen uh, get up on stage, and the stage being the front of the bus with just a microphone, and sing a song of their choice. And the funny part is, is we give them headphones and we crank crank it up on the headphones so that they can't hear what they sound like. Oh, it is just awful. It is. It's, it's hilarious. If you're singing a good song, you know, you may get the, the blessing of the crowd and they sing along with you. But if you don't, you're just, you're just on an island up there. It's brutal. I sang uh, Just Can't Wait to Be King from The Lion King. And I went with uh, Rapper's Delight by Sugar Hill and the Gang. <laughs> I went for the, the Wow Factor. It's a long song, and I know, you know pretty much all the words. Let's hear, Come on, let's hear it. Come on, let's hear it. Let's hear it. Let's hear it. I said a hip. Hop, uh, <laughs> hip, it, hip, it, hip, hip, a hop. Don't, don't stop, stop the rocking to the bang, bang, boogie, see, up, jump the boogie to the rhythm of the boogie All to right, beat. Something good. like that. That's, yeah, we're done. We're done. We're <laughs> done. When I was colorblind, when I was, when I, when I was colorblind. Back in my yeah. day, when I was colorblind. <laughs> no, uh, when I was growing up, I, uh, I was colorblind. Yeah, uh, I played a tournament one time in the fall in high school, and the lines were red, and I just had no idea that there was even lines on the field. Uh, it was on a grass field, and they were painted like a, like I don't know, like a, a, some some shade of red that I couldn't see. And a few times, I was on the bench, and people were like, "Will get off the field?" I was just like three yards onto the field, so I had no idea where the line was. Oh, I take I take my little sister with me to to buy my clothes for me. Yeah, it's it's humiliating, and yet it's still very necessary. <laughs> I'm pretty sure I'll always be colorblind. Uh, I have no idea. I've heard some people like grow out of it, but I've also heard some people get worse as they get older. So, we'll see. You know, everyone in my family has played lacrosse. I had two cousins who played here on the girls' team. You know, my dad's been the coach hmm. here for 27 years. All my uncles played lacrosse in, in high school or college. You know. I will say a lot of times I'll, uh, like, it'll just be late at night or something. I'll be like, yeah, like, what'd you do? And he'll be like, oh, like, I went and shot around for a bunch. And I'm like, wow. Like, we just had a long practice. Yeah. How are you still, <laughs> like, wanting to go shoot around? So I can attest that he is very passionate about lacrosse. Thank you. Thank you. Got your back. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's brutal if that makes the if that makes <laughs> Please the cut. let that make That's the cut. brutal. <laughs> Will Corrigan. Nick Ocello. Student. student athlete, athlete. Irish. Irish.